Welcome to the Frontline 3D Bathroom Planner. In this video, we'll introduce our bathroom planner and explain how it works. It's fast, easy and user-friendly, as you'll soon find out. In only four easy steps, you can design your bathroom, save it, print it for reference and send it to Frontline. On the left-hand side of the screen, there is a selection box and on the right, there is a toolbox where you can make changes to dimensions in the relevant boxes. Just type in the details or click to activate or deactivate your choice. However, if all the boxes are grey, you'll not be allowed to make any changes. So let's now make a design. In step one, you select the room shape. To do this, choose a bathroom shape as similar to yours as possible from the selection on the left hand side of the screen by clicking on its icon with the left mouse button. You'll immediately see the room shape on your screen. In the right hand navigation, you'll see that you can flip the room shape to best reflect the shape of your own room. You can then change the dimensions by clicking on a wall, which will change colour when clicked, holding the left mouse button down and then moving the mouse up or down, left or right, until the room is to your required size. However, the most accurate way is to type the measurements into the relevant boxes on the right side of the screen in millimetres and press enter. Once you're happy that the room shape is accurate, you are finished with step one, and we now move on to step two. In step two, different elements can be dragged and dropped into the room by clicking on them, keeping your left mouse button pressed and dragging the item into the room shape. The first thing you can do in step two is add any doors, windows or structural features such as sloping ceilings to represent the features of your own bathroom. Again, the dimensions of such features can be amended in the relevant boxes on the right hand side of the screen. Once you have all the basic room features in place, you can then start to select the frontline products you wish to see in your bathroom from the list on the left hand side of the screen. If you want to see the model in 3D before placing it in your room, just click the object once to select it and it will then appear at the top of the box on the right hand side of your screen. Then click the preview object in 3D button and you should now see the model in the middle of your screen. You can rotate the model or zoom in and out by holding the left mouse down and moving the mouse side to side or up and down. If you want to tilt the product, just press the space bar while holding the left mouse button down and move your mouse up and down you cannot make a print of a 3D model on its own. To go back to the bathroom, click the back to the bathroom button. To complete your bathroom, add the products that you want to include to your room shape and you will see that the approximate price guide so far shown at the bottom right hand side of your screen changes as you add or delete products. You can jump from steps 1 to 3, forwards and backwards at any time. If you want to see what you've done, just navigate between steps 2 and 3. After placing the products in your room, you can move them around in two ways. First of all, using the left mouse button, select the model, keep the left mouse button pressed and move your mouse up and down, left or right. You can also move the elements with the arrow keys on your keyboard. The four keys determine the direction. Click on the object once with your left mouse key to select it. You will then be able to move it 10 millimeters per click on the arrow key. To move it 100mm per click, hold down the shift key at the same time as the arrow key and to move it only 1mm per click, hold down the control key at the same time as the arrow key. 
Elements can be placed off the walls by ticking the free placement checkbox in the toolbox on the right hand side of the screen. To delete an object, just select the model by clicking on it once with your left mouse button. And then you can either press the delete button on your keyboard or click the delete object button in the toolbox on the right hand side. In step 3 you can finish the room by choosing your tile colours and viewing your bathroom in 3D. Select the colour of the walls and the colour of the floor by clicking the required colours using your left mouse button. You will see the changes immediately. To view the room in 3D is very easy and simple. The standard way is to rotate the room by clicking the rotate icon and putting the cursor in the drawing, keeping your left mouse button pressed and move your mouse the way you want forward, backward, left or right. If you wish to tilt the bathroom slightly, click the up and down arrows icon and again, just put the cursor in the drawing and move the mouse forward or backward. The auto rotate button will activate immediately when you select this option. And finally, you can select the top view button by putting the cursor in the drawing and moving the mouse forward or backward to make the view from above larger or smaller. We advise you to make prints of the drawing in step 3. You can make as many prints as you want and from different sides and angles. In step 4 you complete your details and send the design to Frontline. Don't forget to make a print of the details you've sent to Frontline. The design prints and part lists will ensure you have the right information when you talk to your local dealer. The local dealer will receive the information from Frontline and will take over from here. We hope this video has been useful and we thank you for your time.